Hi everybody, um, I wanted to do another quick video for the current injections that I'm on, the Lupron. Um, today is Tuesday, May 10th. I've been doing these since Saturday morning. I do them in the morning between 10, uh, 6 and 10 a.m. They're pretty easy. I wanted to do another video to kind of actually walk you through the whole process because in the beginning, I think the other videos that I have, it was just me being scared and you didn't really get to see what I was actually doing. Um, and on top of just filling everybody in on our story, I wanted to kind of be educational in the process. So um, I was going to walk you through this. It's pretty easy. Um, this is the kit. It's a two-week kit. Um, it comes with all of the needles that you need, alcohol swabs, and then this little vial is what we are, um, you know, sucking into the syringe. Um, I'm going to set this up here. So this has to be refrigerated. So first I just kind of warm it up in my hands. Um, it feels a little bit better if it's going in closer to room temperature than it would, um, you know, going in if it was fresh out of the fridge. That would feel a little bit weird. So we'll just kind of roll it around. You can leave it out for a little bit and just let it, you know, warm up. So I will be doing these until the end of this month. I started on the 7th. <clears throat> and next after this, I'll be starting the estrogen patches. And then after that, about six days prior to our uh, embryo transfer, I'll be starting the progesterone injections in my butt. I'm not looking forward to that. That one's gonna be difficult. So I'm gonna take a syringe. This is pretty easy. You don't have to mix any of the solution. It's already pre-mixed in that little vial. You just open it up. <clears throat> My dosage is 10 units. <clears throat> Excuse me, sorry. So it's just this little guy. I don't know if you're going to be able to see the needle. It's very, very, very small. See that? So <clears throat> you take the Lupron vial. You There's a little hole in top. It's kind of like a little rubbery hole. You just stick the needle right through the center. Turn the bottle. Like I said, I'm 10 units, so I would take in that much of the solution. Kind of go a little bit past, make sure there's no air bubbles. And then I go back up to 10 just to make sure I'm kind of getting the air bubbles all out the top. <clears throat> take it back out. Recap it for a second. That's all set to go. Take an alcohol swab. <clears throat> And they tell you to switch from one side of your stomach to the other. So I've been doing this side of my stomach for the last, I think, three. Just because it's a little bit easier because I'm left-handed. So today I'm going to start over here. Just clean off the area you're going to inject. Let it dry. Okay. Uncap your needle. You're all set. Pinch. Get back here. Pinch the spot that you're going to be injecting. I got lots of belly chub from all these meds, so this is super easy for me. Then you literally just inject it and push down the little level lever to get your medicine. Um, ready? One, two, three. I can barely feel it, actually. So I'm just going to really slowly inject... And then I give it a second to kind of soak in, they say. Um, sometimes when I pull the needle out, there'll be some drops of the medic medication coming out of the needle. So I like to make sure all of that gets into my skin. And that, pull it out, you're done. You just recap your needle, you're done with this. Put it in your sharps box, and you're all set for the day. Do that every morning. So uh, next time I update you guys, it'll be probably... For the estrogen patches, that's kind of self-explanatory, so I don't know if I'm going to do a video on that. But definitely the progesterone shots. That'll be a real fun ride for everybody. So, All right, talk to you later. Thanks. Bye.